Good afternoon, everyone. I was listening to um, Jehovah's Witnesses Weekend Watchtower, and the nonsense that we had to went through is still going on with Watchtower. In their magazine, they was talking about people having a, a, a circle jobs. In other words, being a lawyer, doctor, engineer, um, working on computers, something that um, will help you later down the line to have uh, a better career. Uh, make it money t so you can have your own home your stuff that uh, you want a new car it's true these things material things it can come and it can go I agree but when you have a false religion a dangerous cult coming in feeding you lies about Put God's message out. Go door to door. is more important than having a career that you can have so you can um, do things that you want to do. People, look. Many of us had listened to Watchtower's lies and look what it got us shitty jobs uh, some jobs you only get maybe above minimum wage they barely pay for your bills put food on the table and have fun going out doing different things so I'm telling you in this video do not depend upon watchtower telling you what not to do do what you want to do because this false religion is falling apart pieces by pieces they are crumbling Sooner or later, it's going to affect you. It's going to affect your congregation. And you're going to remember. People like me try to warn you. What's coming ahead. Very soon. Your religion is going to be destroyed by the governments. For the cruelty. Misconduct. Lying protecting pedophiles all these things it's true we're supposed to forgive people for their sins but when you their sins is turn your family friends against you and against everything you believe believe in from Watchtower and you thought it was the truth and find out you never had it now I had someone left a comment telling me that I left Jehovah Witnesses to take the Bible and try to understand it by myself and he said that's a no-no wrong I'd rather understand the Bible by myself, let the Holy Spirit guide me and teach me, to listen to the governing body who's been lying to me about the Bible teaching. I have learned nothing but lies. I would be ashamed to go door to door 
to carry that 2013 perverted Bible and their false publications that's not supposed to help you help you to learn the Bible and help you to stay away from the Bible. It is time for people to understand you're giving your life, your free will to these cults. You're taking your critical thinking and trying to make yourself stupid at the same time. When we all had that thinking ability to learn, to gain knowledge, and to do many things that can give us enjoyment and caring and compassion. These qualities you will not have or never will gain when you're a Jehovah Witness. This is a guarantee because people when you give your life to the devil and all his false religions do you think you're going to get eternal life happiness joy you will not find this in Satan's organizations of false religions so I'm asking you to think before you join these people or think maybe you need to do education work to see for yourself why many of us have disowned watchtower disowned being a Jehovah's Witness disowned the evil slave class you call the governing body Because there is no truth when there's nothing but so much lies has been proven time after time how wicked and corrupt Watchtower is. Do not, I'm going to repeat, do not give up your job or anything of yours for a dangerous cult, false religion, and ignorant men who is forcing you to obey them. So the reason I'm putting up this video is to get you to think for yourself. The reason why People like me will speak up and tell the truth. Now, if I'm not telling the truth, then I wouldn't be making these videos. I'll be knocking on your door and trying to bring you into a false religion. You of everlasting destruction. I don't wish that upon any human being. It'd be just like King Nebuchadnezzar throwing the three Hebrews into the furnace. Had it three times hotter, if I, if I remember. That's what we are as Jehovah's Witnesses. We are luring you in into a furnace that's going to burn you and there ain't going to be no angels there to protect you. There ain't going to be no Jehovah that's going to be pulling you out of that fire. There's not going to be Michael the Archangel who they claim is Christ is going to rescue you. People, it's time to stop believing 
all the lies of Watchtower and stop believing something that we've been telling you. My mission has always been the same to be truthful and honest and to get you to think for yourself. I don't want to control you. I don't want you following me and thinking I am the way and the truth. That is Christ's privilege. All I can do is point you the right direction. And I can guarantee one thing. Watchtower is not the direction I'm going to point at. If anything, let me kick you in the rear and, and so you can turn the right direction and search for the tr true Christ in a real Bible. Because believe it or not, I wish someone would have knocked me silly and kicked me in the rear end to wake me up. When some of the clues was already there and I just overlooked it. That was my ignorance for not going no further. Maybe I was scared what would happen if I went to the elders and told them this makes no sense. Christ warns us there will be false teachers. And boy, we got a bunch of them in the Kingdom Hall. And all the way up to the governing body. People, it's your life. You have to answer to God and Christ. If you continue walking in the faith of these seven men, the governing body. One of these days, your chair, you're going to be sitting on. It's, if you've got four legs holding you up, it's going to start falling apart and you're going to land on your ass sooner or later. So before that happens, people, please, do yourself a favor watch a bunch of our videos and see the truth for yourself. I'm not asking you to come out to be an atheist and this other stuff. I myself when I came out I was determined to find the right path. So what? I was serving a false god. So what? I was worshiping Michael the Archangel. So what? I was worshiping false men claiming they'd know how to um, give me eternal life. Now you may say that's not worshiping. When you take the real Bible teaching and just ignore it and believe in Watchtower's lies, you are worshiping Watchtower, but not putting faith into the Bible where the true worship is. So people, it's your choice. I hear some clicking noise, I have no idea what it is. You got to choose the path you need to take before it's too late. Otherwise, you will be doomed. You will be doomed. And what do you have? Nothing there to pick you up, encourage you anymore. And that's what exactly what Watchtower will do. They will kick you on the street throw you out any time for speaking up and trying to figure out am I in the truth or ha have I been lied to 
you got to take the courage, the strength to answer the, these questions. Because you're going to have to know sooner or later when you're watching these videos, you're going to go blind to go back to watch Tar, or you're going to wake up and realize I told you so. I want you to be my brother and my sister. The ones who left this false religion. So people, don't give up your day job. Don't give up your night job. No matter how many times they tell you it's the right thing to do, it's not. It's a dangerous, stupidest thing you ever have done in your life. Giving up a good job for a false religion. So that's all I got to say and I, I hope this encouraged anyone who's watching this. Because by doing research like we did, you will gain accurate knowledge and you know where to put it later on in the hands of our Father who created us, not in the hands of Watchtower and the governing body. Thank you very much and I hope you all enjoy your day. Bye bye.